If you take a trip to Central Kentucky, you have to make a stop at Mammy's Kitchen in Bardstown. This is Christy Clark, otherwise known as Mammy. But you come from a long line of Mammy's, which of course is what you always called in your family, your grandmothers. Yes, I was so fortunate to be raised up in an era where I, I had grandmothers that were in a storybook. They were like a storybook. Grandmothers, they had the bonnets, they had the aprons, they worked out in the gardens, they had the children, you know, they had you know, 15 and they had 18 children and then, uh, you know, they milked the cows and they did all the, the farm work. I can't imagine living back in that day and working as hard as they did. And now you have five kids, but you also are a young grandmother. We call her more of a glammy mammy. Uh, that's for sure. <laughs> but you take that role with pride. I do. And especially, I mean, you opened Mammy's Kitchen in 2006, and one of the specialties of all of your grandmothers was their cooking, and that has definitely yeah. Transfer you know, as a to child, you. I remember watching, you know, I didn't get to cook so much because I was young, but I remember watching, I can remember tasting each, you know, down to just the mashed potatoes and how they prepared all their dishes and how precise they were and how it was from, from you know, farm to table, from garden right to the table, you know, all those memories, not many memory, don't have much of a memory right now, but I can remember back then and I certainly want to bring it to my table. Absolutely, and you have indoor, outdoor seating at yeah. the gigantic, gigantic yes, we place. actually setting where a horse and carriage were, would have came through. You know, they would have come through the front and came out the back. And so right here, you probably had a, a derby horse, you know, getting shooed. <laughs> now you are also known, I mean, your food all down home cooking, homemade from scratch. I've filled a photographer who's been with Great Day Live since the very beginning and lives not too far from here has always told me when you go to Bardstown, you have to make sure Mammy's Kitchen because they're known for the down home cooking, but especially your pies. Yes, we are. Chocolate, butterscotch, lemon, and coconut cream are the four favorite. And I fix desserts, we do cobblers, but our pies is what we fix every day. And we do about 30 to 40 pies every day. And it's just a meringue pie, it's an old fashioned pie, and it's from my grandmother's recipe book. What's the one thing, in addition to the pies, that if somebody comes here for the very first time, what do you say, okay, I'm just gonna recommend this? You know, I think you've gotta have some of breakfast. You know, breakfast is just, it's a, it's a lost art. It's so simple that it gets kind of lost and just, you know, fried bologna and cheese, you know, uh, three eggs scrambled or, you know, eggs over easy or poached eggs. I love it. You know. Okay, Christy, if I want to pretend like I'm part of the Mammy's Kitchen family, you've got this saying, what am I supposed to say? Country cooking makes you good looking and you're right here where it all starts. All right, country <laughs> cooking makes you good looking and you're right here where it all starts at Mammy's Kitchen.